Hi guys, welcome to Code Bashers. Guys, in this video, I will be discussing the latest interview experience of Tech Mahindra. This interview happened yesterday only, that is on 2nd August 2024. So, as many of you were requesting on the Telegram group, sir, please post the Tech Mahindra interview experience because we have our interview still 5th of August, so start posting it. So, guys, here I am with the video. Make sure that you are watching this video till the end because every question and every answer I will be discussing in detail. Do hit that like and subscribe button before moving ahead because more such videos regarding Tech Mahindra I will be posting on this channel. And guys, I will also tell you that where from where you can prepare. I have a notes, special notes for preparation. Okay, how to access them I will tell uh, in the uh, later part of the video. So make sure that do not do, do not miss any part of this video and are watching this video in the end. So guys, now let's start this video and before starting the video, please hit that like button and do join the Telegram group. Okay, this is a special group for 2024 batch where Tech Mahindra Mind Tree discussions are happening. The link will find in the description box. So now let's start with the interview experience. So first question was, as you all know, will be introduce yourself. In any company you go, the first question will be introduce yourself. By this question, the interviewer tends to know that, okay, what the candidate has done. Okay, you can include your skills, your extracurricular activities, your education background, your projects, your internships, any achievements you have, all these things you can uh, add it in your introduce yourself. Next question was explain OOPS concepts. So guys, there are mainly four OOPS concepts, abstraction, encapsulation, inheritance, polymorphism. How to explain these into the interview? I have a dedicated video for it. I will give the video link in the i button or in the description box. Make sure to watch it for this start. Okay. Next question was explain inheritance and types of inheritance. So guys, what is inheritance? Inheritance is one of the OOPS concepts wherein the child class inherits some of the properties from the parent class. Now there are different, different types of inheritance. There is a single inheritance, multiple inheritance, multi-level inheritance, hierarchical inheritance and hybrid inheritance. Okay, so there are like hierarchical and oh, sorry, multiple and hybrid inheritance are not in the are not present in the Java, but these are just the overview of the inheritance. Next question is explain constructors and types of constructors. So there are three main types of constructor. One is a default constructor. Another one is a no parameter constructor. Another one is a parameterized constructor. Okay. So again, how to explain them? You can like check what are the definitions. You can check anywhere else. Now guys, you will be thinking, sir, okay, these questions are fine. But how to prepare for these questions? Okay. Once we have given the interview, now we know the questions. But how to prepare for these questions? So guys, for that purpose only, we have the notes on our top mid page. That is important interview IT subject notes. In these particular notes, total 12 subjects we are covering. Okay, 12 PDFs you will find C++, Java, Python, DBMS, SQL, coding questions which are asked in interview, operating system questions, networking questions. So in every PDF, we have around 20 to 25 questions related to that subject. Okay, with answers that are very important for the interview as per your interview is concerned. If I give you a sample, like if I will open a C++ PDF. Uh, so in this C++ PDF, so you can see here. I have on the top only there is a question what are the types of inheritance in C++ okay so there I have explained you with the help of diagram also every single for single every inheritance I have explained in detail with the code also so total 20 to 25 questions led to C++ are there in these PDFs okay these are very important uh, questions as per the interview is concerned so we have analyzed different different interview experiences and then only made these PDFs similar is the case with Java also and other other subjects also that in every pdf around 20 to 25 important questions are there and guys if you are if you are if you are doing last minute preparations for the tech mahindra then these notes will be very much beneficial for you because in this interview also that the interview that i am sharing 70 to 80 percent questions are present in these pdfs only like i've shown you these types of inheritance is there ex constructor and types of constructor is also there in those pdfs in those notes if i move ahead explain binary search algorithm so if you will see this coding questions uh, uh, pdf you will find that i have given that this is an important question as per the interview is concerned okay so these are at a very nominal price of price of rupees 99 the link are in the description box okay if you're interested in buying if you want to do your last minute preparation or you have to revise your concepts you can buy this the links are in the description box okay these will be very much beneficial for you in the interview just at a rupees 99 it's a very nominal price okay moving ahead in the interview so what is the use of double equal to operator in java so two things for primitive data types like integer or something it compares the actual values now for objects it compares the references references means the address so if you do a1 double equivalent to a2 
so it will compare the reference of that object okay the address of those objects so i hope this question is clear to you next is tell me the difference between stack and queue stack are object inserted uh, so stack follows the leafo approach and queue follows the fifo approach this is the simple thing okay next question is tell me about your project again project plays a very important role in your interview okay uh, how to explain your project in detail and what are the commonly asked questions from project i have made a dedicated video for it i will give the video in the i button or in the description box do check that out okay moving to the next question is what was your role in the project so if you have done all the project on your own then okay if you have done it in the group then you will have to explain your specific role in the project okay next question is check if a string is palindrome or not so again this is also important question for the interview some basic uh, uh, coding questions are asked so you can find this on the link and it is present in the notes also this particular question next is explain normalization in dvms so there are four types of normalization 1nf 2nf 3nf and bcnf so i will not explain you every normal form in this video because this video will become long the main idea of this video is to give you the uh, sense that okay what are the different types okay next is difference between group by and having clause so group by clause is used to group the data according to a particular column okay we will group the group the data based on a particular column having clause is that it is used for applying some extra condition to the query like for the select keyword we have the where clause similarly for the group by keyword we have the having clause okay i hope this is under, understandable next question is what are sub, sub queries so query inside another query is known as sub query for example is this so this is a sub query okay i hope this is clear to you next is explain wild card characters in sql so there are two main wild card characters one is this percentage sign another one is the underscore so percentage sign represents zero or more characters underscore represents a single character okay i hope it's clear to you okay and then there are some more wild card characters also but you can check for them okay next is the hr question where do you see yourself after 5 years so you can give any answer to it next is why you want to join tech mahindra so any company you are joining you should know that why you are joining that company okay next is will you relocate so again it's dependent on you always say yes in this question okay will you relocate so these are all the questions which were discussed in this particular interview okay so i hope many of the questions were clear to you any doubts you have you can uh, write in the comment section and you can join a telegram group also where the discussion regarding tech mahindra and mindtree are happening okay and if you are if you want to prepare for these interviews for the and you are like you are don't have any time you are doing last minute preparation or you want to revise any concepts you can buy these notes at a very normal price of rupees 99 the links will find in the description box check them out okay do hit that like and subscribe button if you found this video informative thank you for watching this video